Hey guys, what is good? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. How we doing? It's Beacon Lulu. And guys, we came on here today to get on the channel 11 and finish these heroes. And you guys know what's going on here. I mean, if you're a longtime fan, you know what's going on here. Guys, we have set this up. So we are ready to go to max on all of our heroes at the same exact time. Like we were gonna go one, two, three. And you may notice I'm saying we were gonna do this because guys, there's a couple different ways we could fix this, but look at right now, since we have the gold pass, when we click on this, the upgrade takes five days and 14 hours. And the whole point of this is because we want to be here when these upgrades finish. We want to sit here as they count down three, two, one, boom. How are we going to do that if it's if it's one in the morning? Like right there, that would end um, at two or three in the morning for me. <laughs> What? Like, I can't be online then. Like, no. So look, we could use a booster potion or we could just wait a couple of days until the season ends. I think I might do that, dude. Because once the season ends, there's no more gold pass. And it's the weirdest thing. Like, I wish I could shut off this, this builder boost thing. Yo, look at that season bag. I haven't even played it all this, this season. It's so sad. Did I even get the challenges done? Oh my God, I didn't. All right, gang. Well, if we're not going to go over there today, let's go over here. If you've been following along, you know we're in basically the same exact position over here. We got a, a Grand Warden that's two levels away from Max. And look at the King. He's one level away. Guys, I think we got to do the same thing over here. And it's not going to be the same exact thing because we already have two of our heroes done. But what if we do the same thing over here? We do the Warden one time and then we just hit the Warden and the King at the same time. It'll be like a practice run. Oh my God, we got to do this, guys. All right, guys, you want to take this? Oh, wait, we don't have a choice. What am I saying? Uh, hang on, let me get Grandpa's lucky hat. Dude, I went over to, uh, I should have wore this when I went to Christmas. And, you know, I saw, like, Grandpa and Grandma and everybody. They, <laughs> he definitely would have said something. Anyway, guys, let's get in here, do this up. Um, we've been doing it a little, di little differently because I'm bringing three jump spells now. And that's just to make sure that we clear the corners. And especially on bases like this. So let's see if we can do it. Here we go. Let me do something like this. No, I wanted to go to the bottom one first. All right, uh, we'll figure it out. What? All right. Um, all right, don't get distracted. No, no, no. hi -ya! Okay, perfect, perfect. So now, guys, we can drop, hopefully, a packet in there. Yeah, buddy, look at that. That's awesome. So now we do the same thing over here, hopefully, with a jump and the packets. Um, let's do one whiz. Uh, and then we need another whiz over here, right? Yeah. Come on, gang. Just go in. Just go in. This, is it. this isn't going to work, is it? Perfect. It worked, dude. I can't believe it worked, but it worked. So, guys, let's go over here. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Oh, I need to jump in here. What am I doing? What am I doing? All right. So, guys, the whole point of all that mess was to clear just a little bit, but I think it's going to help so much. I mean... We have to try. It is such a nightmare lately trying to get these ring bases to clear because, you know, with this army, it's kind of a spammy army. The whole point is just to, you know, spam and go. And that's really fun and it's really effective. But I don't know if your troops just go around the outside. It's, it's not very effective. And still, dude, still, it was hard to clear. We still didn't get into the middle. Uh... <laughs> okay, see, we, we got to just figure out what to do with the late. You know, at, towards the end of the army, there's got to be a way that we can seal the deal. Like, in this case, yeah, the queen's going to get it. Okay, great, cool, whatever. I'll save the warden ability. I don't think we need it yet. What is that? Yo, warden, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, I'm going to I'm gonna keep that frosty boy going. Keep it going, bud. He's, like, on the brink of death. That's so funny. All right, cool, man, cool. This was garbage. It feels like we we tried so hard to clear those corners and it was still just garbage. But anyway, we're gonna do our best, like guys. Let's just do a couple more. And really, all we gotta do today is just do a couple of raids. It doesn't really matter what we do because we have enough loot for everything. Like we have overflowing dark elixir already, and we have enough elixir to do uh, the warden, which I think is really all we're gonna do today. So let's get it. All right, gang, here we go. Um, dude, I've got so many new like hoodies and track jackets I want to wear. But actually, the, my favorite one's green, so I guess I can't. It sucks, dude. I, the green screen is great. I love it. But you can't wear anything that's like blue, or a, a certain type of blue, or anything even close to green, or even yellow. Why don't we clear again with P.E.K.K.A.s? That's what we've been doing. So I think, where's the queen? Oh, man, she's right there. Um, Let's go from the town hall side. Yeah, we'll do this. Boom, boom. <laughs> Look at 
at those pekas, dude. Take them out. Yeah, buddy. That's awesome. All right, so let's go in the middle. Oh, looking good, dude, looking good. So we'll go in the middle with the siege. Um, let's do that. Let's do a balloon check for traps. Heroes. I love just dropping all the heroes at once. It's really cool, man. There's something about it. I love it. All right, so rage. Oh my God, this single inferno. Are we, what? Gang, are we joking? Oh crap. Um, let's get some jumps in here. I sort of forgot that we had to, had to drop the jumps. It's really weird when you don't have, um, Whoa, when you don't have the siege, when you don't have a, a ground siege, which I'm really used to. I mean, when I don't have a ground siege, it's, it really throws me off, but it honestly is so good to have this new siege. This new siege barracks is so good. So anyway, it's worth it. You just gotta get used to dropping the uh, dropping the jumps. So let's see how far we can get, guys. I don't know if it's gonna be a three star, if it's gonna be a crappy two star. You, you just don't know until, you know, around this point in the raid. I mean, I think we look pretty good. We've got a P.E.K.K.A. over there. We got a couple of Yetis, right? Nah, maybe not. It's like two. Um, we'll see. We'll see. It's a fun attack though, man. When it works, it works so good. And even if it doesn't work, you still get a good two star. And I think that's the best kind of an army, you know? Cool. Lulu, you're looking pretty chill today. How you doing? Cool. We got her some parsley last night as like a, I don't know, like a belated Christmas gift. Dude, she, she just goes crazy for parsley. It's so funny. Parsley is that stuff that... I mean, when I was a kid, I didn't even think it was food. It's the stuff they, you know, at like a fancy restaurant, they just toss on your plate. And I don't toss it. It's like for, for decoration. I was, I was like, what is this? This isn't food. Lulu loves it. Whatever. Anyway, guys, um, hmm, man, I would love to get some more elixir. <laughs> We're sitting here in such a weird position. Like, uh, all the elixir is in basically open storages that we could just snipe if we had, I don't know like one dragon, but I think this stuff over here is probably gonna go down. Yeah, the king and, and the yetis can get it. Yetis are good, dude. Yetis are really good. You can't bring, or at least I can't bring like a ton of yetis. It doesn't work like that for me, but if I use like four or five, yetis are so good. All right, guys, that'll be it for uh, this one. I, I'm good with that. Let's go back. Cool. You know, I should try to leave people with their dark elixir because I don't need it. I'm full on dark, so I should probably just, you know, not be a jerk uh, and not take their dark. So 92%, that was 92%? Wow. Okay. Okay, I think this might be the final one of the day, guys. Perfect, perfect, this is a good base, finally. Okay, so I'm gonna get, uh, yes, I have a better siege. Okay, cool. So guys, this is what we want to find. We wanna find kind of a, you know, what is this, like an anti three star base? It's gonna be easier. We've talked about this, but like it's way easier with this. So let's just get spammy. Here we go. Boom, boom. Cool. Boom, 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 boom. All right, we drop the balloon. Healers. Let me get a rage down right away because I want to... Wall breakers, did they work? Yes! All right, now let's get these yetis. Did I just have a... <laughs> did I just, I just have a lisp? I was like, yetish? Yetish? Okay, uh, I don't know why I dropped the heal spell there, but I did, whatever. I should have dropped a rage spell because we need to speed up, but let's get going. Here we go. So I got a, uh, a couple of jumps here. Let's get one right there. Oh, look at this mess. Look at this mess. Ah, okay. Is anybody gonna continue into that compartment? Let's get the king ability. Let's let's go gang, let's go. Uh, let me drop a jump. Oh crap, that jump wasn't far out enough. Oh, ah, oh, what a mess. What a mess, what a mess, what a mess. Um, I guess I'm gonna use the, the new hero ability. Dang, that, that wasn't really where I wanted it. Um, okay, well, somebody's gotta take this out. So can we do that? Cool. Okay. Dang, I can't believe this one didn't, ah! These bases always go down really, e not easily, I don't wanna say easily, but like, they always go down really efficiently because, you know, you take out the town hall early. You take out a lot of the, you know, heavy stuff early, like the heroes and, Stuff like that. And then everything else just go down, goes down like a breeze. And this one, it seemed to fight back quite a bit. Maybe it was just how we use our spells and stuff. But, you know, what I can definitely say is this army's getting tougher to use already <laughs> because people are using those ring bases. I, I think I should honestly use one too, probably. Um, change my base a little bit at least. We'll see. Anyway, guys, I think that's going to be it for today. Let's go back and do what we came to do. We're going to just do the warden. We want to get him up to within one level of max. That's basically it. And we have plenty of elixir to do that. Let's go.
Oh, and I think we also just finished this. Look at this. Yes. Yes, dude. Okay, so when you get 4,000, I don't know if you guys normally do this or not. It's not the biggest deal in the world, but it's nice because you help your clan a lot and you also get an extra reward. That's gonna be sick. Dude, I wish I had another builder. I don't know what to do right now. So we got to either finish one of these upgrades that's like a long upgrade with a book, or we could do a short upgrade with gems and we could save the book for something else. Um, either way, I mean, they're both good options. I think we should probably finish. Let's see here. Dang, you know what? I don't really care about the expo yet. I think I want that scatter shot, dude. So I'll just use the gems. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a bunch of gems. So let's do it. We'll save that book for something else. Wow. Peace. Yo. I wish I could have gotten a snapshot of that. What? Cool. Anyway, guys, look at this. Oh my God. Look at these beasts. This is going to be so cool to see in defenses now. Now that we have these two max scatter shots, it's going to be crazy. They're, they're really annoying on defense. Anyway, guys, let's get this over here. Grand Warden. Man, what should we do? Should we let it just sit here and upgrade for a little while? Yeah, probably. I mean, I don't need it this second. It's fine, actually. All right, guys, here we go. Grand Warden going down to one of the final levels that he's going to have to do, at least for a while, until we get, a you know, another update. Here we go. Boom. <laughs> That's so sick, dude. I love that. So we might, uh, hmm, what should we do here? Should we use one of the boost builders things? I don't know. I'll figure it out after, guys. Anyway, for now, we are done. What we have to do, as we said, is wait for that to finish. He's going to be one level away from Max. I'll we'll probably do it tomorrow. Like, we'll do it with gems or something tomorrow. Um, and then we'll do the King and the Qu and the Warden at the same exact time to Max. I can't wait, dude. It's going to be so fun. Anyway, guys, for now, that is all. Thank you for coming out. We love you guys. And if you enjoyed today, let us know in the comments below. Leave two for Lulu and all that good stuff. Be sure to use code BEAK. Um, I realize you guys can't really see it up there. There we go. Man, that looks so good. Like having it one level away from Max is honestly pretty cool. There's something about that that I love. I know I love all this weird stuff in Clash, but I kind of love that. Cool. Anyway, guys, that's it for today. Like we said, we love you. Leave two for Lulu. Let us know how you do in the comments below, and we'll see you right here tomorrow on Beaker's Lab for more of this weird garbage. We'll see you then, gang. Peace.